Jason from the eScooter Co. And uh, I thought I'd share a little bit of information or top uh, top tip, top riders tip. Um, basically, one of the most important things on your scooter is how you actually set it up. Um, and that's the geometry of your scooter. And that, that gives how you ride it and how you uh, control it different feelings. And one of the most important things is, is where your brake levers are. Um, I generally set up my scooters and anything else that's got a brake with what I call a low angle of attack. So on my left hand, this is what comes out of the box. Now the problem with that, in my opinion, is I've got to open up my hand and sometimes even adjust my wrist to allow me to get to this brake lever. That's quite a lot of movement, okay? The big problem is, is it leaves me vulnerable to being lifted off the handlebars and that's the last thing you want. So on my right hand is how I have it set up, which I call a low angle of attack, is it's actually in line with my knuckles. So I can just literally open it up, pull, and I'm stopping. It's a lot more efficient and it's a quicker line to pull the brakes on. So when you get your scooter, up, a little bit of advice is simple Allen key setup here. Just turn it down so that it's in line with your knuckles. So straight away, I can feel the difference. I'm about six foot tall, so the taller you are, the higher your elbow and your angle of attack is gonna be on the brakes. So at six foot tall, if I've got my brakes here, I've really got to open up my hand, you can see it, okay? If I tilt it down, it's a lot quicker, even with two fingers or three, than the alternative of having a high angle. So that's my rider's top tip. Uh, it could really save you. It's going to give you a better ride and a better feel, and you're going to feel a lot safer. So rider's top tip, low angle attack. Thank you.